Charlotte 19 and 37. They're 11th in the East. The Pacers are sixth in the East. They are 33 and 24. And Miles Turner tried to dribble it past Settler, turned it over. Malik Monk wow. has well, been really good of late. Well, I'm telling you, he sprinted down the court, and I thought TJ Warren was with him. And that's slow already because you're eight seconds until the shot clock. Brogdon has struggled from three point range. It hits there. One of his last 17 He's here in his first year in Charlotte after spending time in Boston. And Warren is going to get started through with a throwdown. Yeah, that's a great start going back home. Don't keep people in front of him. DJ Washington, the rookie out of Kentucky. They bat it out. And a second chance at Bridges makes the Pacers pay for three. Good ball movement. Really good ball movement. Got a wide open shot, which is different than the shot that the Patriots got. 1% for three point range in February. That's 29th. They were number one in the NBA in January as Turner hits on Q. Nice penetration, though. Lost on Saturday at home to Brooklyn after winning three straight all on the road. And Sabonis having his way with Zeller. At this level for 82 games. Now Brogdon finds Aaron Holiday on a terrific pass. Checked in. Ah. And then Sabonis lost it. Well, he made a mistake. He should have given it up. And, and because if he had given it, he turned it over. Daniels, who is also in. Rozier blocked by Turner. Running Brogdon leaves it off. Warren lays it in. And he played Washington at bay. Sabonis doubled, but goes in with a right hand. He's a driver. You gotta know who you're playing against. Blocked again. Nice job in the read by Turner. We are so accustomed to seeing that timing play, and you got some bonus on the floor. Now he's got to deal with Bridges with a right hand. He tossed it in. Be the one protecting, but he's got a big body with Biombo to deal with. McConnell goes inside, finds Holiday, Justin for three. Really good penetration there by T.J. McConnell. Pacers have hit five of seven from behind the arc. They're 12 of 18 overall as Monk gets inside. What the hell? You got a chance. Samson racing. Take the foul if you have to. Oh yeah. my! If you have to, take that foul, but he didn't have to. Get it up. Side wrapped up by Sabonis. Well defended by McDermott. And now McDermott again, right to the rim! Team watched the first three quarters yesterday. They should. You need to fill pain in that circumstance so you can figure out what it is you absolutely don't want to feel should again. Foul. They missed that one. Lord, I agree with you. And Zeller pounces it home for his first. The Pacers had scored 13 straight. Good pass. Really good pass by Domas. Because on the initial catch of the bad pass, you got the matchup you want if you want to get it to Sabonis. Nobody. Eight or more rebounds this year. Who holds the Pacers record for most games in a season with 15 or more rebounds as Rozier hits his first basket? Then he has. Uh, in the last few games. Yeah, this month he shot just 38% from the field, and Turner has his fifth block of the night. Uh, you think Rozier will get the message? And we're in Holiday. It's hard to beat people off the dribble like that. Good read. That was an approved play. Actually, in their last 16, they're the only team in the league under 100 points per game at 98. And Simonis splashes another jumper. The end of the third quarter, and the Pacers had 55 points. Yeah, it was, Chris, it was just an ugly, ugly evening. Oh, no. He got Miles another, got another one. one. That's a season high already this year. And Sabonis was trying to draw the foul. Doesn't matter. Got it to fall anyway. Well, that double team did a good job. Great defense by Holiday to force a Hello. fading shot. Here comes Warren. Blitz. Yeah, he did. He went down. Hey. Bridges, the basket, and a foul. The, the, the real problem you have here, Chris, is with the Pacers. Staying sharp. Has scored six, but it's been the 
Miles Bridges show as now Mark for three. Again, Jeremy Lamb out for the season. Victor Ladipo is missing tonight's game with back soreness. Yes. And Warren starts the quarter with a dunk. New York would be a bit more troubling, even though the Pacers were able to come up with a win. Boy, Brogdon has really looked good tonight. He's got 10. Yeah. The Pacers are a basket away from James Borrego calling another timeout. They sure are. He did. He walked right over. Shot clock down to eight. We've not said that much tonight, Quinn. Shot clock has not been at all a part of this game for the Pacers. Really You've talked about You said in the slow starts and the Pacers in the month of February. And that's the seventh block shot matching a career high. It was the number two pick. And Zeller has spent his entire career here in Charlotte. And the jumper spins in for Justin Holliday. He's got ten. Oh, what a wonderful job defensively there. All body. By Samson. Malik Monk. Malik Monk. And again, a great bounce back game after just great seven hands. points. That's Holiday. Really good hands off the bounce pass, able to get it, knock it down. Malcolm Brogdon with his second three. Corner, the rebound goes to Turner. And two more for Holiday. Tacit, final minute of this third quarter. All Pacers on this Tuesday night. As Cody Zeller over the top of Turner. But he had he, Miles wants to score. I mean, you, that's just who he is. I mean, he likes blocking shots. He just blocked another one. I mean, 82 games, you're going to lose somebody or some combination of people. McConnell with his first basket. Not made a three tonight, but he's made three of those. Ooh. Nearly had that one holiday. Sure did. So McConnell did a nice job ball faking. And the faithful want to give him a little hand to make sure he doesn't get hurt. Big German again. And that's where the Pacers can run that offense. To bonus now 16 times has had at least 20 points and 10 rebounds. You know, you've got to be happy with Jakar Sampson. He got healthy, he didn't get minutes, but when he's called upon, he's been able to produce. He didn't do a very good job defensively there. The first basket of the game for Hernan Gomez, who just checked in. His brother has been traded. He was in Denver now with the Minnesota Timberwolves. Oh, look at McDermott again. You're in double figures. Bridges is the only Hornet in double figures with 17. You just want to sit here and enjoy it. Enjoy it. And enjoy that. Sampson in double figures. 20 for three-point range. He should be that easy. I don't think many people thought P.J. Washington would shoot that three quite that easy. is short. Now Mark. They've scored eight straight with McConnell, Lee, Bataze, and Aaron Holiday. And TJ Leaf is on the board. Alongside Nas Mitru Long, who currently is sidelined with an ankle injury. Holiday inside with a left hand. Some speed. Without knowing for sure that he won't play. Bataze. It was going to be a lot backfield the way because it was a bad lot from Holiday to Goga. Bouncing back, T.J. Warren had 19. An all-around great performance as Bowen inside scores. Let me tell you something. I just talked about how much he scored in the Julie. And Martin misses, and the Pacers win it 119-80. to They become the second team in NBA history to lose a game by 35 points and win the next by 35.